this is your reminder, please put your Amazon Echo devices on mute as I will be using the Waycord frequently in this video. First of all, we'll start with a quick demo. Alexa, unmute my TV. Alexa, set volume on my TV to five. Alexa, mute my TV. Alexa, switch to HDMI 3 on my TV. Alexa, switch to HDMI 4. Alexa, turn off my TV. And that was a quick demo of setting up the Amazon Alexa with the LG TV. I'll go through a full tutorial of how I set this up in this video. Let's get started. The first thing I'm going to do is turn on my TV. Before we get started here, I'm going to assume that your LG TV is already connected to the internet. Now it should have prompted you to connect it to the internet as part of the setup process when you first turned it on. But if not, I would suggest that you hit the gear button on your remote, which is the settings button right here. And it should take you to a menu of settings. And we're going to go down to the bottom one, which has the globe on it. And that is how you get connected to the internet. So let's just check to make sure I'm connected to the internet. And sure enough, you have a choice on this particular TV to have a wired connection or a wireless connection. Now that we've made sure we're connected to the internet, let's continue with this tutorial. And I'm going to press the home button and go back to the home. Uh, in order to set it up with the Amazon Echo device, I'm going to scroll all the way over to WebOS. It's this uh, light blue one, the same color as the Amazon device. And I'm going to select WebOS. And now the screen set up for Amazon Alexa comes up. Now I'm going to select sign in with Amazon. I want to use the same sign in as I do with my Alexa device. I don't think this is required, but I do recommend it just to keep everything on one platform. Hit sign with Amazon, then the Amazon sign in page comes up. Now as a shortcut, I'm going to use my keyboard and I've already done this before. So there's an intermediary step where you accept terms and conditions and you say, yes, I want this Amazon account to be my LG account as well. So I've skipped over that and now I am to the page where it says, what do I want to name my TV? And you've got several choices here. You can call it living room TV, bedroom TV, office TV. Uh, but since I just have one TV, I'm going to select just TV to make it easy on myself. And then I'm going to hit next. Now I need to set this up with my Alexa device, with my Echo. Now on my smartphone, I am going to Amazon Alexa. That is the companion app that you use to set up your Alexa devices. And then I'm going to hit the menu button in the top left hand corner and I'm going to select skills and games. And now there is a search button in the top right hand corner. I'm going to search for LG Smart Thin Q. And this says to select basic and complete. Okay, I, so I do see complete and I do see basic. I'm going to select basic and I'm going to hit enable to use, enabling skill. Now it's going to ask me to sign in with the same sign in I just used for LG. And I'm going to select Amazon at the bottom here and then I'm going to hit sign in. Essentially I'm using my Amazon login as an LG login now. And success! LG Smart Thin Q Basic has been successfully linked. Now it says close this window and discover devices. So I'm going to hit X in the top left hand corner and it should prompt me to discover devices. Ah, here it goes, discover devices. I'm going to hit discover devices. I'm going to wait for a few seconds while we are um, using our Alexa device to discover the LG TV. Ah, and it's ready. It has discovered my devices and I'm going to hit done. And then it says add new devices and groups. I'm going to hit done. And it says four devices discovered view. TV is one of my devices. It's called TV and it is my LG TV. Okay, excellent. So we have that set up now. I'm going to hit done on this side here too. And um, right here, it says the TV name is TV and then it gives me things I can try to work with my Alexa device. So now I can scroll through different commands 
that I can use with Alexa to control my LG TV. Let's give it a whirl here. I'm going to say, Alexa, switch to HDMI 3 on my TV. And there's HDMI 3. I can't really seem to be able to launch one of the apps on my LG TV. So if I say, Alexa, launch Prime Video on my TV. I had trouble communicating with Fire TV. Check your device's network connection and power supply. Oh, it always tries to pull from Fire TV instead of my LG uh, TV. Uh, so if you want to choose something, you still have to use the remote to choose what you want. I'm going to choose... I'm going to choose Sling TV, just get a stream started here. So I have a stream going now, so I'm going to say, Alexa, set volume to 20 on my TV. Alexa, mute my TV. Alexa, turn off my TV. And it goes right off. Unfortunately, I can't turn on my TV yet. Alexa, turn on my TV. Sorry, TV is not responding. I feel like the commands are really limited at this point in time with the Amazon Echo device controlling the TV, but it is quite handy to be able to mute and unmute and change the volume on the TV with my voice. Uh, hopefully there are more features coming up soon. I will keep an eye on that and keep you updated if there are more features. But for now, that's what you can do with your Alexa device with your LG TV. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and I'll see you next time. Bye now.